Well, a pioneer of television, a gentleman and a family man. That is how Hugh Cornish is being remembered tonight after passing away aged 90. He graced televisions across decades. He was a trailblazer in the entertainment industry. And tonight, we look back on his remarkable life and career. When television first went live in Queensland, it was Hugh Cornish on Channel 9 who greeted the audience. I said something like, hello Brisbane, welcome to television, and, and really that was it. The chemist by trade turned radio presenter found himself as the first in front of the camera for this historical moment in 1959. Every time I think of Hugh Cornish, I, I think, I know that we had the best days in the television industry because they were pioneering days. He fit in smoothly as a newsreader, <laughs> bringing the world to Queensland. When I read Queensland's first television news bulletin on Sunday the 16th of August 1959 was the visit of Her Royal Highness Princess Alexandra of Kent. These historic shots of her arrival in the national capital are the oldest in our archives. I just remember him as being just a, a kind, lovable person who would help anybody. It was his creativity behind his success, eventually becoming general manager of Channel 9 Queensland, where he was the first to run the same shows every night instead of once a week. Leave it to Beaver. I think he just knew what people wanted to see. Often market testing the programs on his own children. He put on happy days and I said, that is a winner. And he ran hours and hours of talent shows. One of the first to give the very young Bee Gees their first shot on TV on Brisbane Tonight. This time is passing by. Oh, I suppose they were no worse than any other little boy, but oh God, they were imps on camera. They really were more of a problem than a, than a blessing, I have to tell you. This man was interested in television, you know, he wanted to make entertainment. So, uh, you know, we all, we all chase that. And later on was instrumental behind Stairway to the Stars. Mr Hugh Cornish. Right now, let's give a very big welcome to Bobby Lim. Producer, director John Stainton credits Hugh for his big break. He probably made a more, bigger impact on getting talent known and, and up and running in Brisbane than anybody else I know, ever. Entertainment was at, in his heart. And he was the man that set up the first telethons in Queensland and his legacy means we still have the nine telethon today. So that speaks volumes about the man. Behind the scenes, he suffered tragedy, the loss of his son after a long disability and his daughter from cancer. He'd be running around, going out to see his son, looking after his daughter, looking after the family and he... He was just a stalwart. Eleven years ago, when the analog signal was switched off, Hugh was there. Yeah, a bit teary. Melissa Downs was the last to interview the trailblazer three years ago, where he shared his memories of television. It was just a wonderful era. You had to be there to understand. I'd like Huey to be remembered with a state funeral. He was a lovely gentleman. And... I would like him to be remembered as the gentleman of TV. Hugh Cornish passed away last night, aged 90. Josh Bavis, Nine News. And he 